one. We're here with Cal Poly Pomona Broncos after the 3-2 semifinal win over Cal State East Bay. Um, coach, just open up with the opening statement on the match. Yeah. It's Salvin, I'll follow up. Uh, soccer with his finest, right? Um, you know, we were absolutely incredible in that first half and dominated and um, took an you know, early lead. It's like seventh minute and then played really, really well. It's probably one of the best first, you know, probably the best half we've played all season. Um, came out second half and I thought we looked quite good for like you know, 10 minutes. They were applying a bit of pressure. We made a silly mistake um, and then it kind of got them riled up and credit to them. I mean, we, we actually said in the locker room, they're not going to go away. I think Finn actually said it. They're not going to go away because just of how their chemistry is and how their belief is. Um, they had a great game against us the first year. Oh, sorry, the first game. And um, we saw that same <coughs> intense, you know, um, intenseness from... Um, from East Bay, and, and credit to them, he's, he's done a fantastic job with this program. Um, you know, I think he's got them so hard working and, and full of desire, and there's no doubt that that's why they got here. Um, so yeah, Taylor two halves, um, they could have scored at the end, and uh, fortunately enough, we made a, a good save from Luke and uh, managed to keep the 3-2 win. Thanks. Talk about your uh, your streak now. I think it's 17 unbeaten. Uh, streak now and what does it mean for your team and how you're able to accomplish that this deep into the season? Um, for me personally and I also think for the team the, the streak doesn't mean much if, if, if you don't least win these type of games um, we've had a lot of ties especially in the beginning um, and we've talked a lot about and worked on how can we uh, keep the keep the score sheet uh, zero goals to them and, and then we keep on going and we had a lot of success uh, scoring in the first like 15 minutes in many of the last many games uh, where we won. Um, and it's just about how we push from there. Um, sometimes we, we fall a little asleep when we score the first goal. Um, but today I feel like we, we showed that that even though we scored the first, we won scored the second and third. Um, so, so really good first half. I think the second, um, as Matt said, uh, it's about how we keep on pushing and that not letting them get us too far back. Um, for example, against Sandburn, even though they put in the pressure in the second half, we were very mature and how we we don't didn't give them anything. Um, so it was kind of like a little bit of like a focus, like communication, how they scored the first goal, and, and also cheers to to the fans. They did a really great job in, in helping in helping East Bay's players today. Um, but yeah, it's just about how we, we get that win, and that's the most important thing. Finn, you uh, guys, like like they said, you got up to an early lead in the first half, 3-0, and then East Bay, credit to them battling back late in the game. How are you able to hold on and you know advancing to the championship against the next match winner I on Sunday? I think it's a lot of resilience from us. I would say potentially even earlier in the season, if it gets to that point in the scoreline, we might have crumbled. But I think as a group, we've gelled a lot together we've everyone worked so hard for each other and even when we went conceded those two goals there was still that belief and that desire from everybody to to get through to that next round and i can tell how focused everybody is how how much belief we have now it feels like there's a good belief in the squad and i think that just shows through the performance even though it didn't always go our way I mean, we come out on top and that's all that matters coach yep last question championship match sunday yeah here we are, you, you, here you are again. You got the experience. Yeah. Talk yeah, about I mean, the previous there. Probably the third, I think, since we've been here, uh, since I've been here. Um, we've won one, I think we lost a couple. Um, two of them gone to penalties. Uh, they've always been tight games. Um, you know, I think, I want to say, not have all been against LA as well. So, um, you know, we'll see who we get tomorrow, but whoever, uh, sorry, tonight, uh, whoever we get, you know, we'll be, we'll be ready for. Um, again, I just want to reiterate what these guys said. It's like we're very, very tight as a group, and it's just been a lot of fun. So we hope that journey continues, and uh, Sunday will be another part of the journey. And we hope we, we you know, we get an NCAA bid after that, and um, you know, just pushing on from there and, and how we do. So uh, we're excited. Uh, we'll be ready. You know, we'll be a little bit tired, but it's, it's about squad depth, and um, the next guy has to step up at this point, and we'll be very excited to play.